What's up, card slingers? Squeeby here, back with another deck guide plus gameplay for you all. And today, I am so excited to dive into this deck. It is Timo Caitlin, uh, and we have a whole bunch of new Bandlewood cards. As this is the trap deck, we're going to be baiting our opponents and trapping them uh, in our clutches with shrooms. So. Uh, Karina Mastermind is like the key finisher in this deck. I think this card is insanely strong. Um, and it's, you can either play, plant five flash bombs and traps, uh, the flash bomb trap, which does one, uh, to a random, you know, enemy unit, uh, or you can effectively trigger all of the traps and shrooms in the top five cards of their deck, uh, immediately. And it, it doesn't trick, like, cancel them out like it, it will trigger them and then it will keep them in the deck and they can redraw them so this is a crazy card on six to play and kind of close out the game there um this list i have to give a shout out to impetuous panda on twitter uh known uh rune terror player commentator this deck is sick he put it out there and uh it already has hit rank one um zinc elemental i believe uh hit rank one with this deck so pretty awesome to see this archetype, um, just reaching the heights of ladder, it wasn't known, you know, after the first week if this was just going to be, like, a meme tier or competitive. Um, some new cards that are cool, Lecturing Yordle, uh, when summoned or attack, it creates a poison dart, um, and poison darts do one to anything and plant puff caps, so... This card, uh, Poison Dart, especially, is like a card that Panda was swearing by on Twitter, saying it was great. Um, so you could see it pay off a little bit uh, in some games today, I'm sure. Aloof Traveler's great against, uh, you know, some of those decks like Lee Sin um, that have those combo pieces that you can discard. Just all around a solid card, and drawing your opponent's cards is the name of the game with this deck. It's why we're running a two of, or three of Insider Knowledge. This card is awesome. Both players draw one. It's why we're draw using Veteran Investigators. Um, just you want your opponents to be drawing the traps that you plant. Um, and Caitlyn, absolute powerhouse. Fairly easy to level in this deck. Um, and once leveled, her level up condition is crazy. I mean, you can push easily 8, 9, 10 damage in one turn with her when she's leveled. So extremely strong. Traps themselves are very good, um, especially into, you know, maybe aggressive decks that have uh, only one or two health minions can really help clean those up. Um, I've seen people experiment with the Nox version uh, to be able to trigger flock and stuff like that. I'm not a fan. I like having access to the PNZ burn. Mystic Shot, get excited. Emo, obviously very good. Um, so this is the original version of the deck, but I'm actually running a little bit of a different version um, just because I love Ballistic Bot so much. And I think Ballistic Bot is extremely strong, especially when paired with Puff Cap. I mean, that curve is just really nice and you can get extra value off of those um, ignitions as well as I'm running a one of iterative. I've tried it before and I think copying Karina is actually really good. Copying Puff Cap is good. Copying Bot is good. There's a, a copying enemy units potentially good. There's just a lot of things that you can hit with it that will uh, pay off. Um, so I have slotted out uh, the Poison Dart card. Um, we are still running three of Poison Dart. Um, I just felt like it was a little heavy on the fours. Um, I'm opting to go for the Chump. Actually, though, maybe we just want to make a live switch here and just try it out for the sake of new cards, trying them out. And let's just do this. Uh, it may, we'll, we'll see how this goes, but I think it's a lot, it was heavy on the fours before, so we could kind of test out which one we think is better. Um, but yeah, that's it. I think running Ballistic Bot Package is strong. I'm down to one less trinket trade as well. So I'll post both lists in the uh, description below. Uh, oh, cool. Okay, yeah, we should have some play into this deck. Um, we just got to get some traps going early on. Uh, get some... And not like this would be good. So we'll bank one spell mana, keep bot. Oh, the sand looks... Yeah, this looks pretty good at the moment. Playing Otterpuss on one. Playing Otterpuss on one for and then swinging might even be better than playing Teemo, honestly.
Oh no, and then they're gonna prank our bot. I think this is better though. Hmm. Because of that. Just play Teemo. Not bad, not bad. Okay. We'll probably want to prank next turn the card he predicted unless they play it off of the bat. Don't hit both bots. Okay, that's fine. What did you do? Making that cost three? Oh, interesting, okay. I'm gonna play the one you saw and bank full. Okay. I'm gonna play the next bot and go crazy. Oh, this guy's way better, I think, right now. That's awesome. This is looking really good right now. We've got the engine in full swing. What could this be in terms of da That's three cost. Oh, that sucks. Wow, look at that. Wow, he had the perfect card there to just really stop our swing. They're down to three cards, though. And only two landmarks destroyed. Okay. Um, I think I like playing this here. Stick shot is good. Holy moly. Look at this combo. Hmm. Does this stop anything from swinging? It stops Zerith from swinging. Stops quite a good bit of damage, actually. So Zerith has to get removed, though, that's for sure. Hmm. Can we remove Zerith this turn? I think we need to trade this off, to be honest. Mm, he's taking both blocks, okay. Oh, it hit Teemo because of the... Oh, the predict. Oh, my God. 
Wow, that's so sad. I couldn't play any units that turn. That's... I can't... I have to play units that turn. That's rough. Let's make him draw the card and then prank it. Prank his... Okay. So he already has the arsenal, which is scary. Wow, we're like down to the wire here. Something like this? Something like this? Something like this. Yeah, this looks decent. Okay. What happens here? We play the Puff Cat Peddler. Predict. Yeah. Okay. Passing. So we immediately prank whatever you drew. Oh, I see. Okay. So, obliterate an ally to summon a stasis statue in its place when I'm summoned. Okay. So, one of these... Yeah, if you play this, then you won't be able to play Arsenal. Which is good. So, if I go like this... Then you stasis statue. Impact, augment, overwhelm, regenerate. Okay. Oh, it's gonna give him more keywords, okay. I think we full swing here. Impact, Augment, Spell, Shield, Fury, Tough, Elusive, Scout? No Scout. And no Lifesteal. So, is there a chance? Potentially. Wow, it feels like we're playing against Victor. We have to win by next turn. Draw Corinna? Well, if we had had Aloof, it would have been crazy. Oh wow, nice. Okay. Wait. Oh, she leveled this turn. Okay. I'm gonna stun the strongest. We're one off. That's a lot of puff caps. We might be able to do it. Oh my god. Let's go! Sure, we're wow. starting off into Draven Scion. This is probably going to be rough. Uh, we are not running the Freljord version with freezes. I think keeping Teemo and Mystic Shot is good here. Uh, Teemo, early pressure, Mystic Shot removal. All right, iterative. We'll see if it pays off immediately. This is hand looking a little rough. Oh, Caitlyn is awesome. 
Yeah, getting those traps in early going to be super key. And uh, mushrooms do count as traps for the Caitlyn level. Okay. I think we're just going to do this, honestly. Could pass as well, potentially, but... So, she's going to be great on curve. Wow, two already. That's kind of nuts. Hopefully no get excited here. Hopefully no Draven with survival skills. We really... Okay. Is there a get excited? Get excited would be really tragic. Get excited would be very tragic. Yikes. She was kind of key to our, uh, our strategy there. So what do we want to do here... Do need yeah this is unfortunate hmm. this doesn't feel super good I think we just take these um yeah, I think we just take these, honestly. Probably just toss a prank and bank full here. Block is good to see. Let's make it cost more. And I think from here we can probably just pass. Bank full. Yeah, losing Caitlyn that turn is going to be pretty rough for us to come back from. I think I do like drawing cards for us here. Kind of need a way to generate more shrooms. Like we need Puff Cat Peddler. Uh, yeah, there's a bot. Bot is even, it's somewhat fine. This being in Mystic Range is good. Now, now we may have a burn game plan accessible to us, right? Between bot, get excited, and mystic, potentially. We'll see, we'll see. Playing two of these is good. Like, if you don't have enough uh, traps in, what you can do is plant with the first one and then iterative the second. Wow. All right, we've gotten like really lucky on how many shrooms they've drawn. So let's see, we're at 5 damage here, and then 6 next turn, so we need to find like 6 more damage. Hmm, okay. I think we can pass here. Maybe an Otter Puss though is fine, huh? An Otter Puss for the block might be cool. Oh, wow. I'm gonna say that that's good enough. And we don't have to waste our Mystic. Also counts as a created card for Ballistic Bot. That's pretty, that's pretty good. So we may be going Thankfully, they don't have Scion next turn. Just need a way to not take too much damage. Don't want to kill this before the swing either. Okay, so this is what it is. We're going to have to protect Ballistic Bot. We'll play Otter first if, if they give us a chance. Okay, they're full here, okay? Wow, we've just gotten really lucky on these hits, okay? Have another prank. So we're five, six, we're five away right now, which is pretty good.
Yeah, I mean, this is what it is, I think. We're gonna have to just kill them before the next swing is the hope. This is gonna be really close. This deck is, like, all about kind of... Like, it, there's a lot of nail biters, so we'll go prank first. Ramp plus two, that's pretty good, huh? That's pretty huge. So now spend everything this turn if you want to kill bot. Okay, they're gonna opt to not kill bot this turn. I think we want to bank full here. And now we're going to... Probably just mastermind. I think mastermind is correct. And if we make a good hit here, we can um, insight our knowledge afterwards. Little unfortunate, we're not going to get to see the Yordle come down this game. But yeah, all your games with this deck are just going to be, like, so, so close. Do they draw that Shroom or not? And, like, this is... I mean, these are not the numbers we want to see here. I think we have to go for it, though. Well, they're passing here. Let's try it. This is a Hail Mary. If they play Scion, we're screwed. Please, anything. Oh my god, that's crazy. Oh my god, that's crazy. <laughs> what are we, one off? One off next turn with Ignition? So wait, we know they're in the top five, and that was two and two. Oh, if they draw two, I think we just pass here. Do we ever lose these? Okay, let's try this out. We just need them to draw one shroom. No, they missed both? Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. Um, can we win anymore? I think we have to copy here. And then what are we stunning? Probably the fearsome. That's such a shame. They've used two get ex Oh no, we've we see the second get excited. They've only used one. Holy shit. I 
think I like ignitioning here so we can push a little more damage. Are we are we ever gonna take five? So they're gonna be we're gonna be able to block two, kill one, and then we take like yeah. So I think we're just gonna say that that's what it is. Pass here because we're okay with them not attacking. Obviously. We should be favored here. If they have another get excited, it's where it gets scary. Yeah, or a mystic. This is a little scary. Dang, they had both sentries. That's so crazy. Okay. Can't stop any more damage than this. Oh, this is super scary. They just need a mystic or a second or a third get. We got really unlucky with them not drawing one of the shrooms. I mean, we got really lucky with how many shrooms they've drawn, but... Come on, we could always get luckier. All right, this fucking sucks. Yeah. Okay. Inches, baby. Inches, baby. There's three puff caps in the deck. If they hit all of them, we can... Oh, come on, dude. All right, let's see if we would have got there, though. So sad. Oh, one short with ignition next turn. Oh. Ooh. We've got the mirror into the Freljord version. This should be interesting. They do have access to Troll Chant um, and Flash Freeze. So they've got a little bit going for them on their side. Um, I think we like this, honestly. Maybe find a team more of our own. They didn't full keep. Uh, we have the attack token, so Mystic Shot should hit unless they have Teemo plus Iron uh, Elixir of Iron. Pokey stick pretty good too. I think we just go for the pokey stick here. They want to use it. Tr just troll chain here. That is. We're totally fine with that. That's such a good combat spell they could be using elsewhere. Here, I think we just jam Caitlyn, and should be in an okay spot. Oh wow, they have the Archer, makes things a little difficult for us. Poison Dart, very good if they don't open. Poison Dart is very good if they don't open. We go for... Letting Teemo hit one more time. Getting a nice block here. Let's investigate. Mm, I see. Uh, I think we just go like this. Hopefully this connects. Okay. Get that hit. And now we go here. And play Ballistic Bot. What is perfection, 
They're very ahead of us in the trap game. Plays into a flash freeze a little bit hard, huh? Plays into Brittle Steel as well. Oh, that's big. No flash, no Brittle. Very good to know. Um, can we ever copy and play it here? Potentially. No, I think probably... Let's draw before we have more shrooms. I think we draw again before we have more shrooms. That's good. We've gotten rid of both flash bombs pretty easily. Another Teemo would be a little bit of trouble for us. Okay. Probably gonna kill Caitlyn here. She looking for the level? But they have At vulnerable minus two, sure. Here we can probably swing and be safe. I like the swing. We've drawn them a lot of cards, but they didn't have Troll Chant or Flash when we swung with Caitlyn a couple turns ago. They definitely could have it now, though. So we only have two Flash Bombs. gonna get tossed by aloof there's not much we can do to stop it can poison dart here and put it in mystic range this is looking decent for us now. Look at the trap disparity. Passing seems fine. Um, although pranking also seems fine. See if we hit another puff cap next turn. Peddler. Okay. Emo almost leveled. Probably want to save this for burn at this point.
Should be priced into attacking here. Oh, okay. Now, if we shoot here, Teemo could very well get the hit. Oh, I see. Okay. So, if I play you... Oh, we only have one mana left. Okay. Go for the Teemo trade. Don't we go for the Teemo trade? Yeah, I think so. Got three flash bombs, though? Let's go like this. I like this. Presents a pretty strong open next turn if we hit this. How are we looking? Wow, still one out of five somehow. Look at how many traps are in the deck. We're almost a one to one. Okay. Did we get lucky? We didn't get that lucky. That is all right, though. Hmm. We just kill Caitlyn. really want that to connect. He'll hit aloof if he plays aloof. That's good. Okay. Wow, drawing yourself traps is sick. Planting more flash bombs seems pretty good. doesn't do too much at this point. Let's investigate. Just killing if we swing like this? Eventually, right? I think we can swing like this. Pass the flash freeze? Okay. Block with your own, Caitlyn. Like this. Should be good here. Go. Off cat peddler just putting in the absolute work. Oh, that's a good hit. Arena from them on us could be scary. Wow. Me? 
Okay. Hopefully... We just have to get... Oh yeah, we should be good here. Odds are in our favor. <laughs> Who's gonna win? And we'll do there with seven. Okay. And four. Nice. Let's go. Woo! They almost came back. If they had their own Karina there, it could have gotten scary. All right. Well, guys, that will wrap it up for this video. Uh, it is, although it is hit rank one, in my opinion, it's not the best deck in the meta right now. But, uh, oh man, is it fun. If you love Teemo and you want to experiment with some new Bandle City cards, then this may be the deck for you. I will have the links in the description below. Let me know uh, any other decks you'd like to see me play on the channel. And, of course, like and subscribe if you liked it. Uh, and I will see all you card slingers in the next video. Thanks for coming by. Peace.